Hello, this video is for we connect one router, one switch and four PCs and we configure all network. So we start from router. So we choose a router here. And we have to choose one switch. So mostly I prefer the use this one. So bring this one here and choose the PC so one two three four so this four PC connect to the switch and connect to the router so it's right here so PC one two so we can change here one two and this should be three and we can change the name PC4 okay and first we have to do this thing here we have to change the IP address and write down the IP address so you know which PC have which IP address so we just click here and here 192.168.1.1 and the next one should be here 192.168.1.101 and this one is same thing here 192.168.1.102 and the fourth one is should be 104 so 192.168.1.103 so these are the IP address for PCs and we have to set, uh, set up the static IP for PC and default gateway for this PCs okay and here we go and this is for router default gateway so we just mark here the video. 192.168.1.1 .1 is class C. IP address and subnet mask should be the 255.255.255.0. So this all connected to the same network. So first we have to connect the straight through patch cable from PC1 to switch uh, okay and here we connect another one here to here this PC and this one go this one connect here to this switch and this one connect to this switch so basically we have all the PCs connected to the patch cable so this goes here this goes here so you know which IP address we are connecting to so it's right here so we have to connect this switch to for example I just choose this one here to FA00 right so first we have to set up the static IP address from here and we have to go desktop here and here you see is a 106 is a class IPv4 IP address we configure here so this one is 100 so we go 192.168.1.1 100 and this goes class C subnet mask and default gateway 192.168.1.1 and this we close this one and it should be here and we have to go back here desktop do the same thing for this PC too as uh, it's a 101 so 192.168.1.1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .1 .
dot 101 so here is the class C subnet mask and here is default gateway is the same it's 192.168.1.1 so then we close this one and it should be here and we go the third PC and third PC we have to see is 102 so we have to configure 102 on this port so here 192.168.1.1.1.102 that's it and here 192.168.1.1 and we close this one and same we have to configure this PC static IP address so we have to go here and go it's a 192.168.1.103 and then here subnet mask and 192.168.1.1 and we close this one so this all static IP and this one is connected to right now right and here we go here for so this all connected to right now so what we do here we have to do configure this path for the router to switch because this interface is not set up yet but the PC they are connected to the switch and they are up so we can see is the gateways run and everything is good so we have to go here and just check for like which port is connected so FA00 so we have to go CLI just no display so here enable command for enter config t config t and int or fac interface fa0 slash 0 we want to configure enter ip address 192.168.1.1 and if uh, subnet mask is 255.255.255.0 and enter and say no shut command no shut and exit so we configure all the paths and we have to check it's working and it's look like working so you can see I just change little bit sides so you can see which port is connect to so it should be green in a moment so we have to wait and it's solid green so first we have to check the ping command from first PC to default gateway so first right here because you have to see the IP address is so it's 100 101 102 and 103 this four PC have the this IP address assigned and default gateway is 192 168.1.1 so we have to ping all together and check if it's work so we here come back to run this portion click on here ping ping 192.168.1.1 and wait for and it's reply from the default gateway so then we can go check and it's safe the PC is 100 the first PC and so put 100 and wait and it's apply from 
and we have to go back same thing 101 and check if it's configured correctly so enter and is it applying so we have to go same 102 enter and it's replying and it's good and we have to go the last one is 103 enter so it's, re it's replying from the all sides so it's configured from the router so everything works fine so we have to go here and check the packet so first we have to see the packet goes from for last one to here so we have to go play and just close this one and wait where the packet goes first this goes to the right direction and it's confirming the it's receiving the packet so it's back to the first confirmation so this PC received the packet so this video is for basically we configure one router as one switch and four PCs so how this work uh, thank you if you like my video please like and subscribe my channel thank you